Beyond Forces of the Russian Federation continue the special military operation in the Kupian's direction. Units, aviation and artillery of the Zapad group of forces inflicted fire damage on enemy manpower and military equipment close to Dvorechnaya, Sinkovka, Kislovka in Kharkov region and Novoselovskoye and Stelmachovka in Lugansk People's Republic. More than 60 Ukrainian troops, two armored fighting vehicles, two motor vehicles, one D-20 self-propelled howitzer, and two Polish-made Krupp self-propelled artillery systems were neutralized. In the Krasny Liman direction, Russian artillery and heavy flamethrower systems of the Center Group of Forces hit units of the armed forces of Ukraine close to Nevskoye in Lugansk People's Republic, Yampolovka and Grigorovka in Donetsk People's Republic. As many as 125 Ukrainian troops, three armored fighting vehicles and one Gratem LRS vehicle have been neutralized in this direction during the day. Air Defense Forces have intercepted three HIMARS MLRS projectiles during the day. Moreover, 18 Ukrainian unmanned material vehicles have been shot down close to Dvorechnaya in Kharkov region, Golikovo, Chervonopopovka in Lugansk People's Republic, Slavnoye, Novandreevka, Volnovakha, Nikolskoye and Alexandrovka in Donetsk People's Republic. In total, 404 airplanes, 224 helicopters, 3,562 unmanned material vehicles, 414 air defense missile systems, 8,300 192 tanks and other armored fighting vehicles, 1072 combat vehicles equipped with MRLS, 4424 field artillery cannons and motors, as well as 9091 units of special military equipment have been destroyed during the special military operation. The other side, Ukraine Defense Ministry in a statement said Russia lost 1020 servicemen in a single day, including four tanks. 23 artillery units as well as 8 artillery units and 3 air defense systems. In total, Kremlin lost 169,170 servicemen during the conflict, including 3,574 tanks, 6,921 armored fighting vehicles as well as 305 jet fighters and 290 helicopters. A year ago, on March 24, the armed forces of Ukraine launched a missile attack on the enemy's base in the seaport of temporarily occupied Berdyansk. Large amphibious ships, Orsk, Cesar Kunikov, Novokokask, were damaged, Saratov was destroyed. The myth of the invulnerability of the Russian fleet was destroyed by the well-aimed strikes of the armed forces. This once again proved an irrefutable fact, the enemy will not rest on Ukrainian land, neither on land nor on water. Russia-Ukraine conflict lasts for 394 days, there is still no peace talk between them. Terima kasih sudah nonton, jangan lupa like, subscribe, dan share ya!